finally, finally, Drake has finally fucking replied back to Kendrick, and holy shit, this shit is a fucking banger, bro. What's up, y'all? My name is Bonus, and today, we will be discussing Drake's response to everybody in the industry. Drake's brand new diss is called Push Ups. The reason why the song is called Push Ups is because there's two different layers to it, as far as I know so far. It's because Kendrick has to split 50-50 with Top Dog, so every time... Kendrick drops, Top Dog tells him, give him 50, basically. So push ups, give him 50, blah, blah, blah. And also, the other reason is Kendrick was seen doing push ups outside for, I don't know, whatever reason, but everybody was hyped on it. I was hyped on it too. And me, I'm not even a big Drake fan, I promise you, bro. I'm pretty neutral in the situation. I just love good bars. I'm just a huge hip hop fan, as you can see. Most of you know there's been a war. The big three, Drake, Cole, and Kendrick, have all been beefing. And we've been all waiting for Drake's response. Everybody's been piling on a Metro and Future. Recently, ASAP Rocky, The Weeknd, and even Cole has switched sides. But today, today, Drake has finally responded to everybody. Now let me tell you, bro. When I first heard this track, I was fucking blown away. This diss was actually really, really good. I wouldn't say it's a perfect diss because it's not so much more about facts. It's more so about like personal insults. And some shady shit, but it's nothing, you know, under the under the knife type shit. My metric is like ether, hit him up, and how disrespectful something could be. And this this wasn't really that disrespectful. I mean, obviously it was, but I'll give it like a nine out of ten. Ether and takeover and that shit being a ten out of ten. You know, I feel like Kendrick is definitely definitely gonna come back with something that's gonna fucking shock everybody. But regardless. This fucking response by Drake is fucking crazy, bro. It's fucking crazy. Here are some of my favorite lines. Like your label, boy, you in a scope right now. And you gon' feel the aftermath of what I write down. I'm at the top of the mountain, so you tight now. Just to add this talk with your ass, I had to hike down. Big difference between Mike then and Mike now. What the fuck is this, a 20v1, nigga? What's a prince to a king? He a son, nigga. Get more love in a city that you fun, nigga. Metro, shut your whole ass up and make some drums, nigga. Um, Drake has also talked shit about Kendrick's height, which is pretty funny. Drake is defending himself here. Drake has replied to Metro. Drake has replied to Future. Drake has replied to The Weeknd. Drake has even brought Rick Ross into this shit, which I think is hilarious. And Rick Ross dropped the reply, but I, don't know. I listened to it. I fucking turned that shit off 30 seconds in. One of my favorite lines from this diss track is this. I'm at the top of the mountain, so you tight now. Just to add this talk with your ass, I had to hike down. And I don't know why, but this part of the song makes me laugh so fucking hard, bro. Metro, shut your whole ass up and make some drums, nigga. Let me know what y'all think about this diss. Did Drake cook on this shit? Is this shit whack? How's, how's Kendrick gonna respond to this shit? Me personally, I think Drake stood his ground so far. So far, I think Drake has stood his ground because he's going against the entire world right now. It's Drake versus everybody. Like he says in the song, it's 20v1, you know? But... It's kind of admirable, man. And me personally, I think whoever whoever wins this war, I think they're going to be considered the greatest of our generation. Which is pretty tight because I wasn't alive for Pac and Biggie's beef. Um, I was too young to understand Nas versus Jay-Z at the time. But this beef, I cannot believe is happening right now. And I cannot believe we're witnessing it. I'm so happy that this is happening in my generation it's the greatest artists of our generation going at each other's neck. This is what hip-hop is about. This is what hip-hop is about, baby. Let's go. Leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Let's have a discussion. Please follow, like, and subscribe. My name is Bonus. I'll catch y'all next time. Kendrick is going to come with some fucking heat, and we all better be ready for it.